Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the split tool. It's another one of those tools that I think is invaluable uh, when you're trying to be efficient while using Revit. Um, it's very similar to the trim tool in AutoCAD. I'll just get started with a basic wall here. I'm just going to hit WA on my keyboard. Uh, it's a shortcut. You can also go to architectural and the top ribbon and then go to a uh, wall. Um, so let's go for... 30 feet and we're going to bring it up another 50 and then say we want to go to this point roughly but by accident we come off and that's okay with us now really what you can do or what people have done in the past is just coming here and dragging it but sometimes it goes off to the side so what I like to do is uh, click the wall which is already selected and then there's a split with gap tool and then there's a split element tool um, I like the split element tool which is what I find myself using more often so if you just select that and then select the wall here and select the wall here now these become individual walls and you can easily just select and delete and now you have a perfect corner um, this split command shortcut is SL. Uh, if you just hit SL on your keyboard, you can split. And now you have four individual segments. Uh, if you want to change the shortcut, go to KS on your keyboard. And that brings up your keyboard shortcuts. So if you put in SL, you should see split. So, alright. Thank you guys. Let me know if you have any questions or comments below.